before you watch this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, tell a friend. Girl, just tell me some love. I'm trying. I'm hungry right now, you know what I'm saying? I be going through moves, ways, and shit. Make this shit. Worth it, man. Comment on my shit. Use waiter. Make sure y'all use this code. Eat up. Free delivery. I'm gonna put it right here. Let me put it right there. Make sure y'all use the code. Eat up. Hey, what's good, my people? What's good? What's good, man? We back. We back. I know it's a little different. I know it's a little different, and I can explain. I can't explain. But listen here. <laughs> Listen here, man, we back. And I, as y'all can read the title, do not stay past this moment. Nobody dies. So listen, this is a spoiler video. I went and I watched F9, Fast and Furious 9. I had to. I've been waiting on it to come out for two years now. Two years. I had to go watch it the first chance I got. So I'm going to start. I don't know where I'm going to start because I got a lot on my mind right now. On everything that happened. You know what I'm saying? So if you did not, this is the only one that I'm giving you. If you did not already go watch this video and you don't like spoilers, you need to go ahead and go. This is not the video for you. All right. So listen. This movie was so, so rushed and so stupid. And if you did not watch one through eight, you will not understand this movie. Like, I had to rethink of some stuff that happened in, like, Fast and Furious Tokyo. You know what I'm saying? And, like, and I think uh, Fast and Furious 6, I had to rethink some stuff. Like, it's so many subliminals in here. If you didn't watch the movie and you still here, stay after the credits because there's a big leak that's going to make you understand, I guess, Fast 10. Yes, there is going to be a Fast 10, and there's probably going to be a Fast 11. I feel like there's two more coming out because Cypher don't die in this one. She gets released again. Yeah, I'm spoiling everything. I just told y'all leave. So don't come, don't come at me with all that. All right? So Cypher escapes. Mr. Nobody apparently is killed at the moment. He probably faked his death again or whatever. But he killed at the moment. Cypher escaped the little box they had in or whatever. Dominique Toretto, brother, John Cena is a brother. bitch. It's a long time, though. And the reason why John Cena, I guess, never been brought up in none of the other fans is because Toretto kicked him out the family. But, you know, they, that's, that's, that's stupid, too. You know what I'm saying? That's, then... They still trying to act like Brian is alive, even though we know this man died in real life in a whole car wreck. Like, he really was living that life. Um, Tyreek think these hello. people are invincible. I don't know what the hell wrong with Tyreek. Bro, I know. No, Tyreek, you are him. tripping. You are tripping. They go out of space, bro. This how I knew this movie was doing too much. These people that went out of space, and they don't even show how they get back. They don't even show how they get back from outer space. Somebody explain it. Somebody explain how these people went to space and they got back. Exactly. I wait. Exactly. The um the Chinese dude, he everybody know he's still alive, but apparently he done raised them a little daughter that ain't even his. Mr. Nobody done pulled him to the side and had him on a secret mission or whatever. Um Bow Wow don't look like he aged at all. <laughs> Bro, this movie just toe up and it's everywhere. Like, I'm not understanding. This movie was really rushed. And through the whole movie, you get flashbacks of why um, Dominique Toretto kicked John Cena out of the family. Like, you, like, the whole thing is a, like, a build-up flashback or whatever. Dominique ended up going to jail. The nigga look like a jailbird. Come on, man. But uh, he ended up going to jail. You know what I'm saying? Then, on top of all this, all this is going on, right? They're doing a flashback. These people trying to get into outer space. Dominique Toretto brother, John Cena, is just doing too much through the whole movie. Tyrese is still hungry. Bruh, 
the movie is just everywhere, son. The movie is just everywhere. It's a lot of, if you like action, if you like explosion, if you like straight to the point, like the movie literally start off with them having to hide the baby. Dominic Toretto had to hide his baby because some people pull up. He's scary, boy. Come on, man. You done went through all this. You got to hide the baby. Then the kid, he like three or whatever. Man, boy, smart. Let me tell you, boy, smart little three-year-old. But it start off with, with them having to go to like a jungle or something and go retrieve a piece that Mr. Nobody hid because he was going to get kidnapped or he died or whatever. It's just a lot. It is a lot. And if you not freshened up on the first eight, you're not going to understand nine. You're not going to understand it at all. If I had to rate this movie, I'm giving it a seven. And that's being generous. Y'all just spent all this money on this movie, all this money on this explosion, but it don't got no good background story, like, at all. Like, whatsoever. They rushed the shit. They rushed this. They rushed it. But I was happy to go see it because I had been waiting on this movie for two years, I say. Two years. Just for me to see Cypher ass still not die. I am disappointed. How long they gonna keep this shit dragging out, bro? How many of these you gotta make? How much money do y'all want from us? Huh? But, man, so basically, my conclusion on Fast and Furious 9 is, it's overrated. It's not a good storyline. They, it's too much action in, in certain scenes like that don't make sense. They don't tell why, like, John Cena get backstabbed by Cypher. Like, it's just so much. You got to go watch it for yourself. And if you already watched it, you should understand. If you already watched it, please, in the comments, talk to me. Tell me how y'all feel about it, because I'm disappointed. I am really disappointed. Good thing I went when the movies was cheap, you know what I'm saying? Because I would have been pissed. You know what I'm saying? But... Thank y'all for watching the video, man. Hope I ain't spoiled too much. Look me in my eye. Look me in my eye. Look me in my eye. I know you just heard me say look me in my eye. I know y'all to watch this motherfucker. I ain't get no comment, no like, no subscription. I know y'all to watch my shit. I'm about to delete this motherfucker.